everyone, and welcome to another edition of Abnormally Normal here at Cheyenne Mountain Zoo. We know things out in the world right now are not so normal, uh, but we're trying to keep things as normal as possible here at Cheyenne Mountain Zoo. So we're gonna show you about some of the things that we do with the giraffe and a really fun, unique type of training session today. So that'll be really fun. I'm Rachel, I'm one of the keepers that's lucky enough to work with our giraffe here at Cheyenne Mountain Zoo. And my name is Kayla Ringa. Thanks for joining us today, you guys. So what we're gonna be doing today is making some fun hoof prints with our giraffe Nisichi that you'll meet in just a minute. So what these hoof prints look like, ta-da, are our end products. So we have trained our giraffe, um, along with hoof work, to present their feet for us to be able to take, um, to paint them and make some fun portraits with them. So these will be available on the Cheyenne Mountain Zoo website for you guys to purchase. All right. Well, now we're gonna go over here and meet the star of the show, Miss C2. She's one of our resident giraffe artists. She seems to really enjoy doing these hoof paintings. Um, she's actually the one who painted all of the ones that you guys just saw. She's really excited. That backing up that she's doing right now tells us to open the door, or she thinks it does, so we're gonna go ahead and do that. Let me know when you're ready. So now that Miss Ciju has presented her foot up here, all I'm really going to do is brush it off when Rachel gives me the cue. Brush. And, and this gonna... type of training is really similar to our hoof trimming training that you guys may or may not have seen before. Brush. So they're doing the same type of behavior they would do to present their hooves to us for hoof trimming, but we've taught them to also work with us when we are doing this type of painting. So she's gonna allow us, like she is right now, to put some tempera paint on her hoof and then allow us to put a canvas or a piece of paper up to that hoof to get an imprint of it, which is really cool. We get to be artistic when we're doing this as well. We pick out different color patterns, try to come up with a lot of different things so that everybody has a lot of options when they're picking out their cool hoof paintings. What's really fun about this is it's kind of a cool way for our draft to be little artists. Just, well not little, they're big. But be artists just like we can be and move. And right now, especially with the world being the way it is, we're staying at home and doing lots of fun projects to keep, our, keep ourselves busy and engaged. And so this is something similar that we're doing with the giraffe. The type of paint we're using is a tempera paint. So it's water soluble, it's safe for the giraffe, it's really easy to clean off. It's the same type of thing if you kiddos or you have kiddos at home doing finger painting. This is exactly the same thing that we're using here with the giraffe. Do you want more? Yeah. Touch. Move. Okay, brush. Brush. And you guys might recognize Missy too. She is pretty well known in our giraffe herd. She's actually the mom of our most recent calf, Viv, and she is also Ray's mom, if you guys remember Ray. She loves to train. She's probably one of the biggest pigs out of all of our giraffe. So she will eat crackers all day long, so she loves doing this. When we're training for any behavior, we give them lots of crackers or favored food items or things that they just really like. With the giraffes, they love these rye crisp crackers. So it makes painting a really fun experience for them. And they leave with their tummies full. Okay, All right, move. And you can see that she's allowing Kayla to do all of those things with her feet voluntarily. 
So Misitu's way of letting us know that she's okay with painting and wants to be a part of this is by keeping her face near this target stick right here, this big tennis ball I have on a target stick. That's the giraffe's way, uh, way of communicating to us that they want to participate in training. And obviously she also will come and approach that block and put her foot up there. So she gets to make the choice whether or not she wants to be a part of this. Okay. Good. That is our giraffe painting in a nutshell. It's really fun for us, and we're really excited that you guys got to come be a part of that today and watch us do that. Maybe at home you guys can do your own type of giraffe painting and do some fun finger paintings or things like that as well and see if you can do the same type of stuff our giraffe does. Or you can purchase paintings as well and have comparison ones. That would be super fun. Um, so we really enjoy that you guys got to be with us today. And hopefully you guys are out there staying safe, staying at home, and doing great during all of this. And it's really fun for you guys to come visit us.